Hello YouTube, another flashlight video. Uh, this one here is from Interstate Battery also. This is where uh, when I first started getting batteries and uh, uh, supplies from Interstate. Very good company. Enjoy the people. They deliver it right to uh, a place of business. I uh, have mine delivered to uh, either uh, one of two different places I work at. So it works out really well for me. Uh, this group is out of South Dakota and the Interstate Battery Group and uh, very, very good people. But anyway, I'm just, it's not about the people, but in, in a way it is. Um, uh, it's a big part of it. But anyway, this particular flashlight here, I absolutely love. I keep one in the car and I keep one in the truck uh, for emergency and stuff like that. And I see that the... Uh, Cable in the back, or not the cable, but the uh, lanyard or whatever uh, string has gotten a little tough on this one. Uh, I'm thinking the grandkids probably sit and pick at it maybe a little bit in the back seat, but uh, uh, it sits really well in uh, one of the cup holders in the back end of uh, my wife's car, and uh, that's where I keep it. In the pickup, I just throw it in the back seat. It's just a handy to have. Uh, it's a pistol grip. It's an LED. It uh, uses four uh, AA uh, flashlight batteries, and uh, it has a trigger uh, grip, or yeah, I should say pistol grip, and a trigger for the light switch. Uh, nothing fancy with it, just on and off. Uh, I will uh, now demonstrate the brightness of it. This one, you cannot adjust the beam on it but it is rather bright um, the next video or the next portion here I'll show you the flashlight apart I'm not going to take the again I'm not going to take the front off because uh, actually I don't think I've ever had it off but uh, eventually someday maybe I'll have to replace the bulb but uh, I think these things will last a long time the back here just screws off so I'm just going to pause it right here and I'll be back. Back. Uh, this is the flashlight with the cover off. As you can see, there's a couple contact points for the battery uh, case that it has. And this is the cover for this case. And there's two batteries on this side and two batteries on this side. And here's the cap in the back that just uh, uh, keeps the battery case from falling out. Here's the contacts. Here uh, are the batteries. So that's pretty much it. Uh, nothing really much else to say about it, but I absolutely love this flashlight. Uh, kids love it too. Uh, it's just it's just handy, and uh, and uh, it's comfortable to, to hold and everything. And it's really got a, quite a light in it. And let me turn it this way, and you can see the LED chip in it. And you can kind of see down below here. It looks like there's some circuitry down. In the bottom here some wires and uh, switch hasn't given me any trouble nice click feel to it that's it well hey thanks for watching uh, have a great day please like and subscribe yeah sorry again I forgot uh, to add the price in. Now, I am not actually sure on this, uh, but I'm pretty sure that I spent about $15 for this flashlight. Uh, I don't think that was too bad of a price at the time. Um, I'm not sure if I'd go any higher than that, but uh, it, 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 I, I might pay 20. But anyway, this has been a really good flashlight for me. It doesn't look like it's built all that well, but to be honest with you, uh, this thing has done a real good job and I've had it for at least three years now. So well, that's it. Thanks. Bye.